What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on Bless Unleashed Beta. I'll shut up because it looks like we got dialogue to start with, maybe. No, just an overview of the landscape. So, I'm going to do my best in this episode to... Um, to make sure that we don't have a bunch of, like, dead time. So, if there's anything I need to cut out, I will. But I want to look around here real quick. Check the mailbox. What do we got in here? Here's a gift for you, adventurers. Golden key traders. So we get resurrection, sickness potion, and salt grilled meat lunch boxes. So I'm going to grab those. Uh, we got a campfire down here. Our main objective is up there. But hold on. What can we do at the used soul pyre? So the warmth soul pyre solar restores your energy. Alright, that's cool. Uh, I'm going to stand here and get back to full health. We're almost there. 97% and full health. Okay. So that's cool. We got farm hands here. Just making sure there's not anything I want to learn about. Alright, I think we're good. There's this up here, so let me do this. Mine. Oh, just got some XP and some iron ore. Nice. So I'm going to grab this other one that we can mine behind the house. Trying to just do as much as I possibly can um, so that I know when the full game comes out what matters and what really doesn't. Uh, there was a very helpful comment on the last video uh, about different stuff that I'm going to start trying once I get there. But let's go ahead and talk to Marco here. Oh, good, you're up. I was beginning to wonder if I'd have to cobble together a coffin for you. What is this place? Where am I? No memory of the crash landing, huh? Can't say I'm surprised. You took quite a fall. My name's Marco, and this is my farm. Don Diego left you here to recover from your injuries. Where is he now? Uh, slow down. You, you're you barely out of bed. I'm honestly impressed you're standing upright at all. My son Giovanni is making some soup behind you. Get some uh, decent food in you, then we'll talk. I suppose I should eat. Alright, Giovanni, let's see here. What do you got? Wow, back from the dead, huh? We weren't sure you were going to make it for a while there. You and uh, old Diego really made an entrance. Practically fell the sky on that griffin. Must have hit my head, I can't remember. Poor thing collapsed after carrying you both away from the island. Came down like a rock. Our shed was completely destroyed when you lost, or when you lot crashed into it. Impressive, really. Uh, sorry about that, Giovanni. Well, you were unconscious at the time. Anyway, you're here for some soup, right? Help yourself from the pot. It's simple, but it's filling. Should get you back on your feet. Alright, so let's just stick our hands in there and dig out some soup. Alright, so now we need to go back and talk to Marco. I want to see, can you... Uh, doesn't look like it yet. Uh, I should probably read this. Equipment you've acquired since the last time you opened your bag is marked in red. Okay, that's cool. Uh, can I set item menu? Here we go. Uh, no. Link in chat. Equip to a slot. Ah, uh, there we go. So we can equip it there. I guess it was already equipped. Yeah, it was already equipped. Um... think we're good I was seeing if I could do more with the the hot bar but I don't think so not yet okay there you're looking a bit more steady with some soup in your stomach I'm sure you've got a lot of questions it's terrible what happened to Talarian world word traveled fast did anyone survive few got lucky like you but the high priestess and anyone else couldn't who couldn't escape those mass murderers and their shadow spawn killed everyone who remained. I'm sorry. Who were they, and why did they attack us? No one knows, at least not yet, but Don Diego will find the people responsible for this. Never you fear. In fact, he was hoping you could help him with that. Once you've rested and back on your feet, uh, that is, where is he? I can, I can leave right now. And exactly how far do you think you'd get in your current state? That griffin that carried you is half dead, and you're not much better. I'm not letting either of you leave this farm until you've recovered. Please, I, I need to do this. 
Well, you do seem to have healed up remarkably fast. Fine, then. Uh, let's see you prove it. Gather some healing herbs from the farm and help treat the griffin's injuries. You owe him. If you manage that without falling over, I'll consider letting you go after Don Diego. Okay, so we need to go collect some herbs. Um, okay, so let's grab the side quest first. Uh, it's odd. Diego managed to tuck and roll, but you were thrown clear through the barn door in the crash. Nearly killed by some monster, then tossed through a barn. Uh, yeah, here you are, waltzing around just fine. I was unconscious for days? Sure, sure, and yet, not a scratch on you, just a few days later. That's not natural, is it? Oh, gods, I'm a fool. You've just lost your home, nearly died, and here I am being rude. Uh, the lads and I are just hungry from working all day, is all. Ignore me. Could bring you some soup. By Fasiria, that'd be right generous of you. We haven't had a chance to stop for our meal yet. If you fetch me down a bowl, it'd make my, make my day a mite easier. No problem. My thanks, friend. We can't stop working just yet, but if you bring me the bowl, I'll save it for later. I'll even throw a little something for you the favor, eh? And to make up for my earlier rudeness. Alright, so... I'm assuming that... Can I just give it to him? I have the bowl of soup. Repairing the damage... Okay. I guess I need to actually go back and get another bowl. No, I didn't need to talk... Didn't need to talk to you, Giovanni. I need to fill a bowl. Okay. Give it back to... Do I just have to share it with all of them, I guess? Oh, no. Just had to share it with them. Okay, that was weird. I guess I could have shared it with any of them. Gods, that's good. I'm half convinced the soup was the secret to your miraculous recovery. Marco's boys... Or Marco's boy may be a bit rough around the edges, but he cooks like the gods themselves. Thank you, gold and XP. Quest tracker, normal spot for quests like this. It says LB plus over. Okay. Wolf pack, eliminate the wolves, and collecting healing herbs. Okay. Gather some herbs, and then... I definitely will kill the wolves. So... I got a Limius root. Here's what we... Here's what we actually need to gather. Okay, so there we go. So we need to heal Diego's griffin, but I want to kill the wolves first. Why are there so many wolves in this field? Let's not pack up. Alright, let's go turn this into Shepherd David. I guess I can loot. Oh, I can. I can loot the wolves. These wolves just don't care. They're just like... They only care if you shoot at them. It's kind of weird. Okay. Actually, I want to test something real quick. Is it the bottom bar? Yeah, it is. Okay, so that bottom bar below my health, that is... That is my experience counter. So that's good. Happy to learn that. Alright, Shepherd David. Oh, Fisiria. Marco's field has been overrun and my precious goats are dead. It all happened so quickly, I don't know what to do. Thank you for doing your small part to help settle things. Thank you for the 300 gold and the 200 plus experience. Alright, let's do this first. Let's gather a little bit of this. I'm just going to try to gather a little bit of everything. So I have a chance to, you know, craft later on anything. So I guess you could just stay in here and... Does this actually give you any experience? I don't think so. Just stand here and hold a chop wood. Okay. Let's go back up here and heal the griffin. I'm going to stand next to this real quick. Get my health back. What can you interact with? It? Um, You can cook, share food, salvage equipment. Okay, sweet. 
we'll keep learning stuff and uh, go from there. Alright, so there's the griffin healed up. I'll be damned. Whatever they were feeding you on that island, I want some. You're healthy as a horse. Good enough for me. Don Diego said he'd be waiting for you and Karzakor. Uh, which way is Karzakor? Uh, easy there, killer. I know you're eager to find out what happened on Talarian, but you can't just run off. The mainland is a massive is massive compared to your tiny island. I'm sending Giovanni to guide you to Karzakor or Karzakor. Uh, at the very least, he should be able to get you to the harbor. Then it's just a short walk to the city itself. So wheat, I'm sure. But just in case you do get lost, remember, look for the river, then follow the main road south. Don Diego is staying with Count Mazzini and Karzakor. His home is the finest in the city. You can't miss it. River, river, road south, fancy estate. Got it. Alright, Giovanni. Time for you to babysit me, but real quick. Let's see here. What is in this chest? Uh, gold, a bag piece and artifact shards there's another one of those mining things over here let me get this get these out of the way real quick before we leave can you keep okay i was gonna say can you keep mining those there's another one right here so let's grab this might as well grab those while we're here they do give you experience, so it's like, you know, my, might as well. Alright, let's get on the road here. Alright, Giovanni. Headed to Karzakor Harbor, huh? Easy, my dad sends me to buy supplies there sometimes. Are you ready to go? Of course I'm ready, I was born ready. I'm going to pack. Let's meet down at the crossroads in front of the farm. Alright, I'll see you there. Oh... Uh, Okay, it looks like these things respawn over time. So, I guess you could stay here and get 100 XP every so often if you wanted to. Yeah, because they continually give you 100 XP and the iron ore. Alright, let's get, let's get down to the crossroads. I wish the I wish the sprint wasn't so I wish the sprint was like continuous. I guess it is you just, you just can't double click it. Like oh no it's not it's not continuous. Once your stamina bar runs out it kind of Uh hello? Okay, so battle pass tier is increased. We got a trainee's helmet, bag expansion. Surprise, as you may have guessed, I won't be joining you on the road to Karzakor. I've got some friends I'm meeting in the city, and I couldn't wait for you. Besides, they're in pretty rough customers. It's better if we travel separately. But don't worry, finding the harbor is easy. Just turn south at the telepost and follow the road. You can't miss it. Left you a bag of supplies to make up for tricking you. I hope there's no hard feelings. P.S. If my father asks, tell him I went with you. You ate my soup. You owe me that much. Okay, so... I am on my own. But... Thankfully, there's a giant beam in the sky. The Wolf King of Kazarkar, or the Kazarkar Roads. Okay, so... Where is this? Okay, so we have a chest here. I'm definitely fighting the wolf. I don't, even if it's OP compared to me, I'm still fighting it. Alright, so we have a Soul Pyre right here to heal myself if I need it. All right, where'd it go? I guess those guys killed it? All right, let me loot these while it respawns and then we'll fight it. Can I, hello game, let me loot this. Okay, what level is this thing? Three. Okay, this thing is a lot stronger than I thought it would be. Got it at 93%. I think I'm just weaker than you should be. Won't let me roll. 
Okay, that did a lot of damage. Okay, use a potion. Get me back up to 100%. Roll. Get that off of my screen. Can I? Oh my gosh, I can't attack at all? Hello, game. I can't attack at all. Um, hold on, run back to the pyre. I don't know what it's... Can I just fight it next to the pyre? Get my health back. Okay, I guess the pyre doesn't work. Oh, there it goes. I don't know why or what happened there. I don't know why it wouldn't let me attack anymore. Okay, I want to let my stamina get back up. I think I ran out of... I got one shot? What? Uh, get back up. I don't have enough recovery scrolls. Uh, okay, just resurrected the soul pyre. I don't know. I, I guess I ran out of arrows is the problem. So I needed to do... I needed to do B. Because I think that refreshes my stuff. I'm going to go... What is this right here? Telepost Marco's Farmstead. Okay. So that's like a checkpoint. I wonder if it's... Fa it might be fast travel. Get my health back up. So I think I'm supposed to cross that bridge right there. I have five hours to beat the Wolf King of Karzakor. Alright, while all my health is regening, I'm going to run over here. I do want to kill the Wolf King because... It's a, side, it's a side thing that I can do. I do probably need to hit, like, level four... weird. This is just empty area. Ah, here we go. Got a chest up above. River. Hmm. Let me grab this chest. And then I'm gonna check Bandit Ambush. Okay, so eliminate the Faceless Bandit. That's kind of cool. We're getting, like, new quests and stuff along the way. Um, so, can I put this stuff on? Oh, no. It's already on. Equipped. E okay, that needed to be equipped. Shoulders. Let's equip that. Okay, didn't get a lot of stuff, but we did, uh, we did get some stuff. To use the bag expansion ticket. How do I use this whole day? Okay, so let's go ahead and go kill the facelet, faceless bandit. Maybe. I don't know how strong this is. I don't know if everything's just going to be too strong for me. Damn, those faceless. They seem to be everywhere these days. A man can't even make a simple delivery without being attacked on the roads. Uh, thank you for helping us, stranger. They'd have killed us for sure if you hadn't come along. Is there anything else I can do? Well... Need to stay here to repair the cart and tend to the fallen. If you're headed to Kazarko or Karzakor Harbor, could you let Douglas know the shipment was stolen? His family was counting on this food to make it through the season. He's bound to take it hard. Alright, so there's another quest. But I need to find... I need to find the bandit. Where is the faceless bandit at? Oh. Uh, here he is. Roll. Okay, I thought he was... Damn it, I messed that up. I could have had, like, three hits off there. Okay, I can actually take this guy. We'll heal. Get out of there. Eh, got a little bit out of that. 3% shield. 
should have him dead there. There we go. Alright, so there's the... We, we did kill one thing. Is he gonna give me anything good? Faceless Captain's Leather Belt. Nice. Uh... Okay, that just auto-completes. I don't actually have to do anything there. Uh, weights. Put on that belt. Can I... Oh, okay. I guess I can't? I was gonna help him. But, okay, he's dead. Um, okay, now that I've equipped some better gear, not a lot better, but let's go back, see if we can kill the stupid Wolf King. I want to kill it, but I don't know, I just don't know if it's possible for me to take this thing. I think if I play it smart, it is, but, okay, hold on. Go back to the pyre, so I can get all of my stuff regenerated. I think... Okay, so... B... D, yeah, B does restock all of my stuff. Okay. Let's come back here. I guess I didn't need to come back here anymore, but... Alright. This thing is not that strong. I feel like we should be able to kill it. I feel like this is the proper way to start this out. Roll out of the way of the little guy. Ah, that hit me. But I can actually take a hit now. So that's good. I can't... Ah, I couldn't dodge. That's a, that's, that's a mistake by me. I, I just don't have... Um, I don't have the dodges down. I want to dodge cancel. But you can't dodge cancel in this game. So it's kind of just... It's kind of just a waste. I get a little bit too, I guess, greedy. I don't really think it's greedy, but I, I get a little bit too into the combo. And then I expect to be able... What the heck? I expect to be able to dodge cancel, and I can't dodge cancel. And dead end. Okay. So I need to get better. I need to make sure I'm not dodge canceling, because... Or trying to, you can't dodge cancel, so I need to not be trying to dodge cancel because that's just terrible. Trying to dodge cancel is just getting me killed. So I guess we'll progress, and I'll try to remember to come back and fight this thing. It does just a little bit too much damage. That's the annoying thing. It two shots you, which I don't think necessarily makes it impossible. I think it's actually probably pretty attainably easy to beat, but, <clears throat> but, I feel like if I was leveled up to, like, level 4, had a little bit better gear, it would be, like, no issue, so. Let's go ahead and advance a little bit here. See if we can get to the main town, and then maybe once we get our experience for turning in this main quest uh, at uh, Karzakor Harbor, we'll be able to come back here and kill it. That should, that's the goal right now. What on earth is this dude? This dude is walking on air. My dude was teleporting through the sky. What did I just watch? Alright, so we got a chest right here. Eh, gold bag piece, artifact shard, treasure chest, uh, pretty, I think it just said something about treasure chest display on your map, essentially. Uh, looks like we got another quest. Oh, no, 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 this is the turn-in quest. What? Fenton's cart was robbed, but we spent the last of our coin on those seeds. Did any of the crops make it? Did they take everything? He says the faceless took it all. Those bloody bandits, why are they doing this? And of course the nobles in the city gorge themselves while the common folk are starving. I can't live like this. Someone ought to do something. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, gold, 247 XP. Okay, so we got our first merchant. I have quite a few high-quality mounts for sale. Please take a look. Small deer... 
I would get the wolf, but I obviously, obviously don't have enough money for any of that. But I would definitely get a wolf mount. All right, so we arrived at Karzakor. Is that potato soup I smell? The farmer's boy sells us some from time to time. You must have come here from the farm up the road. That's some sense of smell you've got, buddy. Uh, what can I say? Food is scarce in Karzakor these days. Funny what the nose can pick up on when you're hungry enough. I just saw that farm kid wander through here. I was hoping he had some soup, but he ignored me. He seemed to be in a rush. Thanks, I'll tell his father when I see him. Anyway, welcome to Karzakor. Can't say it's a great time to visit. Things are getting pretty bad around here. I advise you conduct whatever business you're here for and leave before things get any worse. Thank you. All right, Karzakor Harbor. We got a pyre over here. Oh, we had a, okay, there we go. So we activated that pyre. What is happening here? Okay, I guess I guess I'm just in here. Starving rioter? Aren't there two more people to kill right here? All right, tomorrow. Thank you for stepping in. They would have killed me. People are growing desperate uh, with the grain crisis and all. Grain crisis? The fields aren't producing grain, and the threat of starvation has everyone on edge. The council even shut the city gates to prevent rioting uh, while they try to restore order. They closed the gates. I need to get in there. Well, you're in luck then. Take my seal. I owe you that much, at least. Workers delivering fish can get into the city with relative ease. Speak to guard named Rudavico Sanchi at the main gate. He'll tell you where to go. Alright, thanks. Thanks, my dude. Um, oh, we have a side quest. Hold on. I have another favor to ask, if you're willing to hear me out. While you're headed into the city, can you make a delivery on the way? I've collected these anchory scraps uh, from the Shabiki at the other end of the harbor. Yes, sir, I can trade those or sell those for you. Hey, it's just the bits and pieces that we can't sell, even during a famine. Normally, we just toss them overboard, but the Shabiki are apparently wild about them. Seems a shame to throw them out if someone's happy to take them off our hands, right? Sure, I'll give them to this Shibiki. Alright, so... These side quests are fairly easy to complete, which I like. Uh, so we got an alchemy station. We got another one of these, um, teleposts. So that's cool. Okay, you can teleport. So that makes it easy. We can just teleport right back to the Wolf King, uh, and fight him. We also have another side quest. Shibiki f oh, this is the turnip. Uh, I wish I was better at catching fish. Seems unfair how them humans always catch so much. And the waste. Saw him toss some perfectly good fish guts right into the harbor. Uh, I did. Should be a crime. Uh, that's why I asked tomorrow to save him for me. Now there's a man who appreciates good fish guts. Here are your fish guts. Uh, by my twitching whiskers, look at this feast. Gonna take these straight home to the family. You're a real pal for delivering these, stranger. I owe ya. Feels a bit low, in fact. Not having to pay you back with, uh... Unless I got just the thing. It was no trouble, really, but... Ordo University, 601 experience. Nice. And some skill points, I think. And a whole nother quest. Uh, okay, friendo, let me tell you about this wine. It's traditional Shibiki wine, right? Made with our special secret technique. It's so popular with humans. I've personally seen one sell his own wedding ring to buy it. Wow, that's certainly some wine. Uh... Cars, of course, running low on food, so they've been eating all their grain and fruit. No shame in that. But it also means they ain't got no booze. Plenty of folks in that city must be dying for a drink about now. You help me, so now I'm helping you. Take this wine. I'm sure someone will pay a pretty penny for it. Okay, so... What is... Hold on. What is back down here? Is there anything... Real quick, before we get too far away... Uh, looks like there's a chest. There's a chest over there somewhere. Uh, there is a chest over here. Gold, bag piece, artifact. 
seems to be the standard stuff that tends to be in these chests. Uh, can I lower this? No. Okay, so if I want that chest, I gotta run all the way back around. So, I guess we will. Because, like I said, I'm trying to be thorough, trying to make sure I grab stuff, so... Let's get this chest. Probably more, yep. Gold piece, bag, or gold bag piece artifact shards. At least we know exactly what we're, uh, we're gonna get. Okay, so let's go ahead and continue. Uh, I'm hoping to wrap this up at, like, 40, 45 minute mark. That would be my goal at this point. I don't know if that's exactly what will happen, but that's the goal, is to wrap it up around then. Um, but I want to wrap it up with... I want to wrap it up with the, um, what the, uh, the, the Wolf King. I want to go back and wrap it up with that. Please, spare me anything. Here, sell this bottle of wine, buddy. Oh, thank you, thank you. Please, let me give you something in return. It's some seed grain I found the other day. Don't own land, so it's useless to me out here. But if you can find a way into the city, there are merchants there that will recognize its value. All right, there's the experience to hit level four. Uh, looks like another quest, maybe? Please spare me something. Can't you sell that wine I gave you? What should I do with the sea? Okay. Can't you sell that wine I gave you? The wine is lovely, assuming I can sell it, but until I manage that, I'm still hungry. Larva meat? This dude wants larva meat? With food so scarce, many of us have been forced to make do. I hear that larva... Uh, that live along the liver bank are edible if you roast them. Could you catch a few and bring them to me at this point? I'll eat anything. Okay, well, I want... I want the experience. Or the experience. Wait. Are these things dead? I guess those are dead larva? Alright, let me get this chest. Because this looks like... Does this chest look different? It looks better almost than the other ones. But nope, yields the same rewards. Okay. There's one larva. Two. Gotta get a little bit of damage on there. In this game, it at least, um... It shares it with people in the world, so you're not, like, competing against them. All you gotta do is get one shot in, and it will give you the loot, which is nice. Probably opens the game up to a little bit of power leveling, since I'm assuming you get the experience, too, but we'll have to see when the full... I doubt there's anyone really power leveling at this stage of the beta, but you never know. All right, beggar, here's your larva. Please spare me anything, anything. Here, here you go. That certainly looks appetizing. They used to say that even beggars could eat like kings in Karzakor. What happened to this place? Anyway, thanks again for your help. You've done more for me than most, and I appreciate it. No problem, buddy. Take care of yourself. Wait, what? There's still more to do for this dude? I'm betting you've got a plan to enter Karzakor, right? If you do... Does he give me another thing of grain? Does he give me double grain seed? Okay, so there's the entrance. What is over here? I gained a skill point, which is nice. Okay, so that looks like maybe advancing to, like, the next, next area. That would be my guess. Um, okay, so we got two skill points. So this is our first look at skill points. So unlocking new blessing skills, upgrade requires skill points, obviously. Uh, everything is unlocked, or locked, so we gotta do this anyway. So let's see here. Erupting arrow. Fire a burst of arrows at your target, damaging them and nearby enemies. Then fire a final arrow into the ground where it magically travels and erupts beneath your target to deal further damage. We can increase the damage on this. I want to grab this. And then... Do I want to get one of these? Cooldown reduction. I'm going to reduce the cooldown. Oh, that costs you skill points. 
right? I don't even see where my... Yeah, I don't have any skill points available. Okay. Sweet. Alright, into the city we go. So we unlocked a new skill. Works out well, I think. Uh, what is it? Oh, it wants me to talk to this angry thug. <laughs> what? You think you can cut in line? We've been waiting for hours. That's it. I've had enough. Time to make an example. Wait, I didn't mean any offense. Okay. Kind of hits. He hits a little harder than... Oh, gotta use B. How do I do B? There we go. I have to redo my... I forget. I, I like that... What do you... Really? I didn't even back off that much. Okay. Okay, I guess I failed at my attempt to kill him. Okay. Rudaviki Sanchi. Halt. No cutting in line. I work for Mr. Tomorrow. Based on what? Your word? Don't waste my time. Wait, 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 buddy. I have a seal. Well, why didn't you say so sooner? Fish deliveries go through the post... The postern gate down river. Head south a ways and speak to the guards down there. Thank you. Okay. Thought we'd be into the city by now. Kind of surprised. All right, here's another guard. Ooh, wait. trying to sneak in, are you? Outside visitors go through the main gate. We're not in the mood to entertain deviants. Uh, here's the seal. Oh, you're on delivery duty. You can head inside and speak to Pila then. Better grab one of those fish or those crates of fish first, though. You're here to work, not to wander off sightseeing. Alright. Okay, we're gonna walk this slow now. Why are there so many guards here? We got Tom and Pyla. Okay, so let's drop that. And talk to Pyla. Good work as payment. Take something to eat on your way home. Nowadays, food is more precious than money around here. Uh, where can I find Mazzini Estate? Mazzini, he lives in the Noble District. Head straight north from here and you'll run right into his estate. Thank you, Pyla. Okay, so let's get the side quest out of the way first. Looks like they're in relatively the same direction, but get both of them done. Hello, Sanchel. Uh, hello there. Oh my, is that a bag of grain I see? You don't strike me as the farming type. Why don't you give me that bag? I'll put it to good use. How about I sell it to you instead? It's a deal. Nice doing business with you. Next year is going to yield some nice profits. Thank you. Ooh, 851 experience. Thank you very much. Let's get this activated. I'm looking for the telepost. Shouldn't be anything in the mailbox, I don't think. I'll take a peek, but yeah. Wonder why there's not a telepost. Faceless thug. Hey, guard, why don't you help me here? There we go. Alright, guard, I'll do I'll do your job for you. Alright, so let's try. Ooh, okay, I can get behind that. There are a lot of faceless thugs around here. I can't believe I got I got two of them like one shot. Alright, just die, thank you. I need more faceless thugs. Okay, I guess. Alright, let's go kill you. You know what I haven't been using? Use this thing. Now I have to redo my arrows. There we go. 
Alright, one more to go. That's really bad against one enemy. What, how close do I have to be for it to be, like, not useless? I, uh, that attack is just not good. Okay, well, this guy's weak, so I might as well kill him. Did I just... What the heck? Um, hello? Alright, let's read... Let's get some more arrows going. Alright, where is Don Diego? Need this first. Bag piece, artifact shards. Okay. Where is Don Diego? Hello, buddy. Thank goodness you're alive and well. When I left the farm, Marco wasn't sure if you'd survive the night. And it seems that once again, you, we meet under violent circumstances. Why were those people attacking you? Perhaps they sense the power of the artifact I carry. Don Diego, I think it must... It, uh, I think it best that we take care of this quickly. Who's this? Agreed. Let's get to the point. Allow me to introduce Professor Orfina, the Federation's foremost authority on arcane studies. She has some questions for you about exactly what happened on that island. You mean the attack on Talarian? Yes. Unfortunately, I didn't see much before I managed to saddle Griff and snatch you up. Please tell her what you can about that day. Even the smallest detail may be important. I'll do my best. I'm sorry to ask you to recall such a terrible memory, but this is a necessary... Or, but it is necessary. It is important... Imper oh my gosh, I can't read. It is imperative that I discover what that mage was doing there and why. While well, I wait, I suddenly feel strange. My necklace, just as I expected. If you don't mind, I'd like to confirm something. Please hold this necklace and try to concentrate on it for a moment. Sure. Who? full-blown cutscene time. This is a powerful object. It is Prana. I did not believe this necklace could be so easily destroyed. Perhaps it is no small coincidence you managed to survive the tragedy on Talarian. Alright. Oh my. Simply fascinating. The necklace shattered completely, but could it be? I'm confused. What just happened? That necklace was made of prana. It was an old. It was a relic of the old kingdom, filled with potent chaos energy, and you and you somehow managed to destroy it with your presence alone. Quite a violent reaction, too. How is that possible? I have reason to believe that you are, in fact, a pyreborn, a being blessed by Fisiria, god of order. It seems that Demia, the high priestess in Telerian, was collecting your kind for reasons unknown. It is entirely possible that many of the orphans you grew up with shared your gifts. Why would she keep this a secret? To answer that, we must first discover why your island was attacked. The massacre at Talarian is only one of a number of strange events that have occurred recently. Uh, by investigating these events, we may be able to find the people responsible and get you your answers. Uh, then we should get right to it. Meet my assistant at Ordo University. Collect my staff from him. Then meet me at Galopa's farm. This is the closest of the anomalies... Uh, but, the, but first, stop by the plaza. There's another Talarian survivor there who wishes to speak with you. 1300 experience, a better bow, bag expansion. Thanks. Okay. It's going to be that friend of ours, probably, I would assume, maybe. Okay, so that is clearly a better bow. Just going to go through and make sure everything is equipped that we have. Okay, so let's go talk to Olvera at the plaza. I still do want to kill that... We're at 44 minutes. I don't want to make this too much longer. I wanted to kill that... Wolf King dog thing. University student... Those scat-eaten flea, br flea brains, weak-stomached, overgrown pencil pushers. They can't keep me out of Ordo University. I just... I got just as much right to learn as them. They're kicking me out just because I'm Shibiki. Is there something wrong, my dude? The university guard told me to leave. Said I was naked. Uh, everyone knows Shibiki doesn't need no clothes. We got glorious God's damn fur. Uh, he ju he, uh, he's just trying to push me around because he don't like my kind. It ain't fair. All right, I'll go talk to the guard. Okay, 
That's not... Well, is this another side quest? You look like you've been through some rough times. When's the last time you had a decent meal? I've been a little busy. Uh, that won't do. Food gives us the strength to keep going. You should really prepare a few dishes for the road. How do I do that? Oh, you poor dear. Have you never been out on your own before? While they're traveling, most people cook at soul pyres. See that one behind you? Simply select the cooking options at any soul pyre to view the list of known ingredients. Uh, each recipe will list the ingredients required to complete it. As long as you have all the ingredients, you're ready to start cooking. Why don't you give it a try? Uh, do you have some of the ingredients that I can use? Sorry, honey. With the grain shortage, food is in short supply. You need to find your own ingredients by hunting and gathering. If you have the money, you can purchase them from a grocer in town. All right, I'll get some ingredients. That's the spirit. Now get out there and start cooking. Okay, so we've picked up a handful of new quests, I guess. Not really, but we grabbed a couple of quests. I think this is a good place to call it. Um, I will figure out exactly what we're doing. Um, if we're going to go back and fight the, the Wolf King, just forget that because I can't find the pyre here or the telepost if i could find the telepost i would do that but i don't know let's turn this in hey are those bag pieces you must have found a private treasure chest can i borrow those a second bag merchants use those magical pouch pouches of cloth to expand your bag okay so this just increases my storage and we can come back to him at any point there's the pot is this a whole new quest Hey, you. Yeah, you. You want to make some easy coin? I'm supposed to deliver these potatoes to the demolished district, but that's a dangerous neighborhood these days. Look like a rough sort. Uh, could you take the shipment to the customer for me? I'd be happy to pay you. Sure. We're getting an incredible amount of side quests. So that's main story over there. Uh, I guess I have more bag pieces to turn in. So let's turn those in. Will do. I think I don't have 12. Yeah, I don't have 12. Okay. So I think this is a good place to call it an episode. If the telepost was right here like I would have expected it to be, I would have gone back and fought the wolf right now. But that's all right. We'll call it an episode here. We'll pick up next episode. We'll try to do some of these side quests and whatnot. And uh, we'll go from there. We have a decent chunk of side quests. So not a decent chunk but we have two side quests that we should probably do so i will start next episode with those uh longer episode this time but that's just gonna happen sometimes with these videos depending on how much i want to get done and uh yeah i'll catch you guys in the next one peace